Hey guys, so today we get to start learning kind of a classic. We get to start learning Old MacDonald. Um, if you're looking at your music, which I have in front of me, um, you'll notice that just about the end of every measure, at least the end of the first two lines, has a rest on beat three and then either a quarter note or eighth notes on beat four. That's another kind of pickup like we talked about last week. It's just this one occurs in the music itself instead of at the very, very beginning. We also have more eighth notes here, so that's really important uh, as we practice our tonguing today. So if I just count the rhythm out, I'm going to count out the whole thing because it really doesn't repeat anywhere. So if I count out the whole thing, I get one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, rest. Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, rest. Four and one, two, three, four and one, two, three, one and two, three and four, one and two and three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one. And if you noticed, if you were listening really, really carefully, my last note, my last B in the very last measure, right there, was actually three beats. So a, um, a dot next to a note adds half of the note's value. So this is a dotted half note. It's a half note, which is two beats, and it has a dot next to it. Well, a dot adds half of that note's value. So that means that half of two, a half note is two beats, half of two is one. So we have two beats from the half note, one beat from the dot, together that's three beats long. So I hold that note out for three beats. It's actually pretty simple. Um, and then it does talk about rest at the bottom of your page, but we've already talked about that because we're super smart. Um, so once I've got that rhythm down, I'm going to try and do it with um, my warm air on two, two, two. So I get Once I got that down, I can go ahead and pull out my recorder, and then I'm going to play this all on G, because it's just kind of an easy note to go on, and I get... of the ending there but I hope this song shows you how important tonguing is we have a lot of repeated notes after each other and it's not gonna make any sense unless you have that tonguing down so take some time practice with that today and if you have any questions send me a video or send me an email bye